How is it possible for you to learn any skill super fast? That's the question for Mailbag Monday. Before we get into it, though, I want to invite you to come to my private Facebook group, Funnel Hacker Pro. That's FHP.io. And I give out nothing but value in this group. If you see, I'm pretty much the only guy that posts, and I'm giving up nothing but value. Most people pay to be in groups like this. I hope to see you there. Let's go. All right, so um, the question is, how can I learn skills like copywriting or marketing super fast, right? So there's one thing that I wanna tell you that um, I've learned over time. Number one is you don't wanna learn it fast, um, but you do wanna learn the fundamentals fast so you can start understanding how it works and then you can build uh, on those building blocks. The, the very first rule of trying to become uh, a good copywriter or a marketer or an actor or a painter or whatever. Here's some shit that I heard. Don Cheadle did an interview and he was talking about how a lot of kids walk up to him and say, hey man, I really wanna be like you, I wanna be an actor. And the first thing that he said was, well, hey man, how many plays did you do this month? How many um, workshops have you been to? What, what, what are you doing to work for it right now? There's another thing that Kevin Hart says that says everybody wants to be famous, but nobody wants to do the work. All that to say, uh, and, and, and I'm going to use Mayweather as another example of that. That dude works out every day and he's in the gym, whether he has a fight coming up or whether he doesn't. And he's working out every day when you're not working out. If you want to be a writer, if you want to be a boxer, if you want to be an author, if you want to be a copywriter or you want to be a great marketer, you have to do what copywriters do. You have to do what marketers do. You have to do what boxers do. So what do boxers do? They box, they train, they work out every day. They don't sit around and read about boxing every day, all day. They actually go do the shit. What do swimmers do to be a gold medal swimmer? Swimmer, right? They get in the they get in the pool and they swim every day. Writers write every day. That's right. To to get you on the right path, right there. That's what you have to do. Hashtag every day. Do what whatever your vocation is does. So I took copywriting as a, an example, and to get you started, obviously, I would start right. Well, actually, I would start here. We're the best copywriting books. This is how I started. So what I wanted to do was what I do wherever I go, um, I actually run a search for the top copywriter. Who are the best copywriters? Whenever I look to do some homework, I wanna know who are the top dogs in an in industry? Who are the best copywriters on the planet? Because there's gonna be a lot of gack out there. There's gonna be a lot of bullshit, right? And so I really wanna know who are the heavy hitters. And so now I see that Robert Bly has a copywriting book, Gary Halbert, Eugene uh, Swartz, David Ogilvy, And then when I went and searched for those on Amazon, I saw that these are the heavy hitters. Another thing I did was look for a swipe file place. And so I came here. Now, this is where it's gonna start to get interesting, right? Because you said, Sonny, you told me that I needed to write, but I don't know how to write copy yet. Well, here's where I'm getting to, and this is what I did to learn copywriting, right? I went right here and I found some of the best copywriting ads there were, but I found the long ones. So here's one right here by Gary Halbert, and you can see how long it is. What I did was I took this entire letter, his, uh, it's a famous letter by Gary Halbert, and I hand wrote this out. And I did these for 90 days. I just kept writing, kept writing. One or two of these a day, I just wrote them out, and I kept going through it and something magical happens with this particular process with writing. And if you go look it up, authors of books do the same thing. They will write an entire masterpiece so they can know what it feels like to write a masterpiece book. There's something that happens. You feel the cadence of how they're writing and then you start to see the pieces on how they're piecing things up together and how they're talking because you're actually reading it and you're writing it at the same time and something starts to happen. 
and that's when you start to get it. So as much as you can read books about it, you get the foundation by reading everything you can read and then come on uh, YouTube and listen to them talk. All right, so let's talk about it. Step number one is find the best of the best, right? Who is number one in the field that you're looking for? Who are the heavy hitters? Who are the guys that have been in for 20 or 30 years and they're not fluffing the shit out of you? Who are those guys, right? Sonny T should be in that fucking list. All right, so number two is, then you're gonna invest your money, invest in yourself, okay? You're gonna spell it right too. (laughs) Invest in you. That's number two, invest in you. Number three, I know I'm writing crazy, but all right. So anyways, number three, after you invest in yourself and you're going to study, right? But now what I want you to do is give yourself a time limit because now we're going to do all of this in 90 days. There's no reason why you shouldn't. Now, you might not be a master of this skill, but if you do what I'm telling you to do, you will definitely have a handle on it and understand the fundamentals and probably be past newbie stage, okay? So number three, you're gonna study, right? And let's just say you're gonna study, and I'm I'm gonna surprise you here, but I'm gonna say for two weeks maximum, okay? Two weeks, you're gonna gorge yourself. You're gonna go crazy. You're gonna have a funnel hackathon at your house with Russell Brunson, everything. You're gonna read his books. You're gonna take his courses. You're gonna watch his seminars. You're gonna do the perfect webinar. You're gonna do the dot-com secrets webinar. You're gonna do everything. You're gonna gorge yourself on that. And if this was Gary Halbert and, and Clayton Makepeace and, jo- and John Carlton, you're gonna buy the, the John Carlton copywriting course and you're gonna watch that. You're gonna read his book that he has out called the something of a marketing rebel, right? You're going to do that. You're going to gorge on that. You're going to find out who Jay Abraham is. You're going to gorge on Jay Abraham. You're going to get Joe Sugarman, uh, um, what's it called, triggers. And you're going to gorge yourself on copywriting for two weeks. And step number four, you're going to do the shit, okay? That's it. You start doing it, right? So the number one word here is you got to take action. That's the number one word here. That's the only thing that's going to beat you not winning. I read something just today, and what it said was, you are the worst that you'll ever be right now. You'll never get any worse than what you are right now. Even tomorrow, you'll be better than you are today. And so that's the most important thing, right? So you have to take action. The biggest problem with people trying to learn a skill is they don't dive in, right? So... Here's a word that never nobody ever wants to hear, and you have to be unbalanced, and you have to be obsessed. I think I'm spelling this wrong, but you guys get the point, right? You have to be obsessed. This is a number one thing here. You have to be unbalanced and obsessed for 90 days, right? I want you to get that in your head right now. That means that you would give your wife a warning, you would, you would um, let's just go over this again right here in red. You would give your wife a warning. You would give your kids a warning. You would give your best friends a warning. And you would say, man, I'm gonna be about to be obsessed with copywriting for 90 days. I'm not gonna talk to you. I'm probably not gonna be posting on social media very much. I'm gonna be super involved in what I'm doing for copywriting for 90 days days. I'll see you guys after I'm done. I hope you understand and be a talk, copywriting, sleep, copywriting, join all the copywriting groups that you can find on Facebook. Talk to those people, be in gorged in it, be obsessed, sleep it, dream it, eat it. All you should be doing is thinking about Gary Halbert, listening to him. Uh, well not Clayton make peace more than Gary Halbert, but John Carlton, everything you can find, listening to them on tapes or into your, not on tapes, but uh, MP3 players in your car. Or like You guys can in the States can stream YouTube to your car and shit, right? So streaming podcasts, it's all you should be doing is listening to it 24-7 for at least two to three weeks, or two weeks at max, 14 days. And then after that, you have to do it. 
So if this was marketing, that means you need to start finding out what are the best tools to buy, right? So now that you've done this and now you say you want to do this shit, well, Sonny, now I have to make a little micro list down here. What do I need to do? I need to find out what are the tools. Fuck, not tolls. <laughs> I need to find out what are the tools that I need in order to do this part? What do I need next? And then you find out, you do it again. What are the best tools? Invest in yourself, buy the tools, study the tools, learn the tools, and then do the shit. Use the tools. Just rinse and repeat, right? And then you're going to say, well, I'm supposed to be buying ads, right? Because this is a business and now I need to run traffic to my to my funnels that I'm building because I'm a marketer now, right? What are the best tools, right? What are the best ad networks? What should I do, right? Well, go back up here again. What's the best ad networks? Invest in yourself, right? And find out what you need to buy. What books, what classes, what courses, right? Study it for two weeks and then do the shit. Start buying ads. That's what marketers do, right? So it's just rinse and repeat. Everything you see on this right here, just rinse and repeat. For every skill that you want to learn, become obsessed for 90 days, run this for two weeks, do the shit, and then now you have a list, a sub list, and just keep rinsing and repeating that. Trust the process and it will work because that's exactly what I do and the shit works. There is no substitute for time. When you want to be the best copywriter or if you want to be the best marketer, if you want to be successful, there's one thing that you're going to have to do and that's every day. There are no excuses. There are no explanations. Let's get it done.